Who do you guys think is the most overrated basketball player of all time? And for this one, we're going to go with Darius. <sighs> I picked Kobe Bryant. What? I picked Kobe Bryant. <laughs> you crazy? <laughs> Time out. I was going to let you smoke. No, Mike, let me get a point first. We're going to get a point Everybody goes, number one Jordan, number two Kobe behind him. He's the best thing since no. Jordan. No, stop it. He's not even the second best Laker. I would have took, took Kareem and I would have took Shaq over him. Even if you don't want Shaq, I would have took Kareem and Magic. Magic. Exactly. Magic. So at that point, now, you, now, you, now you're fighting for third or fourth. You're not even the best Laker. You, don't own your you can't team. say, yeah, exactly. So you can't even. We even got to the whole league. Exactly. So you, you, can't even, you can't even go to number two. Let's. Let's let's be honest. Kobe. At best, at best, Kobe. five all time. You can't be two. Um, and second of all, you, you got you got to look at the rings. He won in a system. You like speaking systems. He won in a system <laughs> where he had the most dominant center. And now, granted, Andrew Bynum was garbage. But that year, who was he going up against in the finals? Perkins. Yeah. Perkins He's, wasn't good at the time. No. No. Garnett pumped him up in his hand to be a thug. As soon as Garnett oh, to he had the body. body, he was big. He was a big man. He was like six truly a big man. Half. But he was big when he weighed. Two eighty? Nah, he was like two fifty five, two sixty. Oh, anyway. LeBron bigger than him. I know the big boy too. Yeah, come on, no. It, it, Andrew Bynum was a legit seven footer, and and they they even showed it when he was hurt, and then when they against Boston. They got drunk that last game. No, they lost game six. That's why we lost. Exactly. Yeah, I know exactly. They lost yeah, almost no 40 in that game six. They, they get by them. 40? Yeah. 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 And, you're, and you're the best player in the league? Buy them in there? What? Even though Buy them was so full of trash. Even though Buy them was so trash. Boston couldn't even get 100 points. It, it's 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 based off of it's based off of a system where you're going inside and you got a big man that's doing something. You know what I mean? When, uh, when he had he had go. exactly Shot he had go. Shaq, he got some rings. He had Bynum, he got some rings. When he didn't have a top five center, even if Bynum was up in the top five too. center. Yeah, well, I mean, so, no, yeah. Center. no, but I mean, the two of them combined, they made yeah, like one. Yeah, you know, yeah, and they, they were great. Yeah. They were going no title without no center. <laughs> Kobe needed a center. Even though Biden was garbage outside them two championship years, them two years, he was unfortunately somehow a top five center. I mean, what are you going to put him up against to in, 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 in that era? Other than Dwight Howard, what was he going against? Uh, Joel Anthony. So, I mean, when, when you look at that and you look at how he won, not to mention, everybody knocks Brett Favre, and I'm a Packers fan, but everybody knocks Brett Favre over the interceptions. That hurts you, right? No doubt. Why is no one talking about the fact that Kobe missed more shots than any other player in history? Because he took the most. You and that, that, a lot when you take okay, it. but in, in that point, Monte Ellis is a volume shooter. People don't want him on the team because he'll outshoot the team. Like he'll take you out the game sometimes. Yeah. Westbrook, I love Westbrook. He's got the most fire in the league. He can shoot you out of a game sometimes. Mm. Volume can hurt you. Volume, in my opinion, hurt Kobe a lot, and people won't admit it because he has so much clout. Kobe's one of them type of people. As soon as he says your name and he ties it to something bad, you trash. But at the same time. I don't think we should have gave him that much class. First of all, <laughs> first of all, <laughs> first of all <laughs> first of he said Kobe Bryant overrated. There we Fuck go. no way, man. It's Kobe Bean Bryant. Bean. Five championships. Five. And when it counted, the man five out of what? Five out of eight? Five out of nine? Five out of eight. Five 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 out eight. eight. Man, don't say Kobe is overrated, bro. Pick somebody really overrated, like David fucking Robinson. <laughs> That's an overrated mo. But what, what, what do you think David Robinson is rated? Like, how? He's not really in the top five, so why, why how is he overrated? Okay, but back to Kobe, real quick. Before we go to David Robinson, <laughs> you, you, you miss, you miss, miss Kobe? No, no, it's one really, really huge elemental part of it. What is Jordan's best moment? Game six. Utah, he gets the game. Thank you, shot. he got the flu. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> they they really say he had a stomach virus. They didn't say he had a stomach virus. Yeah, shit. Regardless, he probably was out freaking with somebody <laughs> early in the morning, a little tired. He got out of here. He said he didn't got a bottle, huh? Come on, man. No, but he got a bottle. Fuck out of here with that. Oh, I'm yeah. so dehydrated. Get <sighs> the fuck out of here. Okay. Last second shot, one possession game. Kobe Bryant career percentage is under thirty five percent. Okay, but he you know can't what? hit that shot. First of all
picked up by your forearm and pushed off to get the distance to shoot. He would have got a five. And it's clear they still saw that happen. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, wait, wait. Just like that. What about that? That right uppercut he gave Mike Bibby and bloodied his nose now. Dude. Kobe Bryant. That was an accident. I think it was a head, but it's what it, it was. was. It was something like that. It, it was something. Hey, it must have been a mate type. Right. Right. They were the the Sacramento Queens. <laughs> nah. The Queens in it it must have been. Yeah, it was tell like the Red Fox when he got two pieces by uh, Doug Kirsten. What happened to Red Fox? So he wasn't a thing to whoop his ass. He was <laughs> nah, he, he ran and into the Shaq held him by the neck. Shaq held him by the neck. Get out of here. Nah. Plus, he got pieced up by Chris Charles, too. Show. Write your opinion. Kobe overrated. Tell him to stop smoking that shit. It's not good. <laughs> and he has a child. So, <laughs> so, so he man. Kobe is not overrated. He's not getting the ball. Right. That's why right. Derek Fisher rocked the ball. Alright, next question. Got the next question. So, you got Mike who, if no, Kobe's not overrated. Thank you. Rob, did they persuade you? I say yes. Oh. Oh, right? Oh. I say yes. They did. He persuaded me, but hell no. So, so what? So How can we get a fence on that one? What? That's, 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 that's not a defense. He's not a slave. No, he's not over But no, he's not over it. Come on, man. Uh, he's not lying about it. Because your ranking was he's number two. I don't think he's no, ranked. He's not, number two. I don't think he's, he's ranked. He's rated as number two best shooting guard, probably. Yeah. But no, Kareem and Magic are better than Kobe. I agree with yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. But, come on, man. I don't think he's saying he's rated. So, you guys agree that he made some good points? Yeah. Okay, he made good points. Well, of course, he really made good I don't know. I'm talking about my point. That's my point. Feel passion. That's the passion. passion is. So it's a day as if we're in this forest, man. He came with a nice act. He came out. He came out. He came out the forest, man. All right, all right. No way. So, so the next question is, who do you got? What do you guys think is the most overrated movie of all time? And then we're back on you, Darius. He gonna say some crazy shit. He said Kobe Bryant. Hey, look. You already know he was crazy. All right. Fuck. Uh, for overrated. See, we, we're not talking. We're not talking. <laughs> we know what we're talking. Oh my god! Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm talking. Point, bro. Look at this. He's out. He's it out. Oh yeah. yeah we're talking it. because we need to paint the picture here. We're talking the most overrated. All right. Scarface. <laughs> hey. Hey. The most overrated. I'm not talking just slightly overrated. Man, I'm talking the man, most. Man. Are uh, the most overrated. When you look at it, first of all, Scarface, Scarface was beloved by black people. This one being black, he was Cuban. Uh, second of all, what is that? Wait, 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 wait
the great movie, though. Because it wasn't hitting no cocaine, right? No. No. Right? Right? No. 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 Get the yayo. Get the yayo. Nobody know who the fuck yayo was with that shit. Come on. Get the yayo. Nah, talk about it. How do you how do you go into the interrogation room when they're missing the fucking number twelve on the clock and you didn't catch that? That was the latest you know setup in the world. You got glasses. Nobody else seen that. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even know that. I didn't even know that. Camera, I didn't even know that. Camera pan to the tw the, the clock. Hey, the camera. Because that's God. where that's where the camera was. Listen. Come I don't on, know. Who knows? He said they put the camera pan to the if Scarface was a good you go into a room and you don't see the number 12 on the clock, you're facing, he was facing the clock in that scene. How did you get set up off of that? Because he's counting millions and millions. If we if we talk to Al Pacino, I'm sure he would say that was his most overrated movie. He was better than that. Casino was better than that. No, I didn't see it. I don't I don't mess with snitches. Don't they don't make that the room was way better. I like bosses. That you became a boss. Hey, man. Star Trek. You died at the end. If you really want to be on some boss shit, turn it off. Turn it off. Turn it off. You know what? You know what? You know what he looked like? He was on some, 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 some Tupac shit from from uh, Juice. And that's your favorite rapper. You didn't like Juice? I like Juice, but I'm saying the way he was just. Remember, he was. Man, the top of the world, top hey, of the world. You thought it was ropes. The motherfucker laid at home, man. The fuck it ain't no ropes. Like a barrel, yeah. Like a barrel. Scarface had bulletproof porches. You understand me? Mike, what, what, what did you like about Scarface? I liked the whole movie. First of all, I didn't see it in the movie. And I, the signs were in my neighborhood. I never, I didn't want to see it because I thought it was some bullshit. When I seen the movie for the first time, thought it was an instant classic. The whole, it started off a little slow, the fucking movie was good. Oh, whole premise the was trash. It was, long, and it was long and it was good, bro. It, good. it told the story. How he screwed his sister a lot. How he didn't want nobody fucking with his sister. Killed his best friend for sleeping with his sister and they were married. He was a thug. That's what made it cool because he was a thug. That's big, dog. That's key, man. And he fucking broke the law. Two things in this world. My words and my balls. Okay. Come on, man. Yeah, it was over with The first time he didn't see his sister, he said, hey, my sister's off limits. Don't mess with my sister. He didn't know. And then they got married. He went to the house. Seen her coming down the stairs with a little negligee and it was his friend and he fucking killed her right there at the door. He didn't even give him a chance to say we're married. So if you if you if you haven't seen the movie, don't make comments, dog. You don't even know what happened in the fucking movie. You know what? Movie. Hey. You know why I don't know? Hey. Because the movie was trash to me. I never so liked that fucking movie. Right. We can't go up like for him. Because anything that's that's drug related, he he can Hey. No, go another no, 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 way. And there's nothing to do with that community. I don't care. And no black people in the movie. movie. It's not like it's nothing to do with our community. It influenced our community. No, it didn't. Yes, it did. We trashed ourselves the whole day. Superfly. You might as well say Superfly influenced our movie. That was from the seven. That was the first drug dealer. Everybody wanted to be Superfly. Everybody wanted to strike out, drive a hell cat, and it was black. Yeah, I like Superfly. Exactly. That's my point. That's what it's called. I just like Scarface. No, but hold on. So why didn't you like Scarface then? I, I just think it's it, it looks it's poorly done to me. The, it was not a cheesy movie. Yeah, it's it, it, it it like that. Oh, the that cheesy ass stuff. accent. You know, the, the, the story is cute. Like, everyone talks like that, dog. It's like fucking classic. Thank you, dog. Man. No, no, man. No, it's not just for you because y'all have a comment section. Let these people know, man. Okay. So what did you like about Star Trek? I like the story. I, I like I like come up and I like bosses. I don't like somebody. Who comes up and they work under the right. a lot of casino. I don't I don't like stuff like that. And he was I, like I want you to be number one. one. I want to be one number one. Hey. So I, I like that. He was like that as a dish. And the loyalty shit. I don't yeah. I don't like that. Like if, if you I, this one I tell you this what it is, exactly. and you go against me, fuck yeah. you. Like period. Exactly. That's just how I am. Yeah. And yeah. I can't go fly nobody. It's wrong to kill anybody. Especially people of color. But y'all just want to go up No, not It's a movie, bro. It's a movie. If you can go up in the movie, then why when it happens in real life, you wouldn't First of all, Starface did not kill one black person. Ignorance. Starface killed nobody black. I'm not glorifying selling drugs. I just like the movie. No, ignorance is ignorance. All the way across the board. I like the story. I said nothing about drugs. I like bosses that sell drugs. No, no, he did not say that. He didn't say he sell drugs. He said he like bosses that sell drugs.
we're gonna move on to the next question. But, Mike. But. What do you think oh, about yeah. Scarface? Overrated, underrated? Definitely not overrated. Great movie, man. Great movie. Right. Oh, overrated. It's not even. It's not even his best movie. You it's, 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 his, it's his worst movie. Mm. <laughs> okay, okay, hold on, stop, stop, stop. 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 Be, 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 be. This guy is fucking crazy. Like, like, no, hold on, hold on. Nah, it's classic, y'all. Yeah. I think it's the most overrated. So, okay. Next question is, who do you guys think is the most overrated rapper of all time?